Hi guys, it's Brooke Adams here and I wanted to jump on here for a few minutes. Hope I keep it short, but this is really, really important. It's very important for what's going on right now in our society, in the world. Um, and I want to make this very, very clear that I am no way associated with this product. I get no uh, monetary gain from it. I do not uh, have any sort of collaboration plan with them. So I don't want you to think that I'm sharing this because I'm getting a paycheck. I'm literally sharing this because this is something that the world needs to know about in my opinion um, and that I know could really benefit all of us by taking it and knowing about it. Um, so that product is Virofend. Here it is. You've seen it in a couple of my posts. Um, I take extreme pride in sharing my real opinion on products with you guys. I am approached daily. Um, getting offered checks and stuff to post on social media. If I don't believe in the product, I'm not going to post it. If I don't see real results, I'm not going to post it. If there's no scientific evidence, and this could be on anything, but right now we're talking about Virapin, I don't want to post about it. So when coronavirus started hitting hard, I got on the computer and was searching relentlessly for just for something and I really couldn't find anything and a lot of things I was finding were just scam related um, things that had no medical scientific research backing it whatsoever no doctors nothing and then lo and behold I stumbled on this and I thought hmm you know sounds too good to be true right um, but when you start digging and you see the science there and you see the doctors that are backing this like, wow, okay, a doctor's gonna put their name on the line? Must mean it works. Let me, let me, let me keep digging. So when I started reading all this, I, I stumbled on one sentence, statement, if you will, and it's, and it's no virus attachment equals no virus reproduction, okay? If you can get that in your mind and you understand that all viruses attach the exact same way and this is an inhibitor, then it probably works against all viruses, wouldn't you think? Um, again, I'm not a medical professional, but kind of makes sense, doesn't it? So you've all seen them. This is, I have this out so that I can show you some of the doctors that back this. You can see that. I'm gonna post this stuff also um, at another time. Here's another one. These are real doctors, you guys. So, I'll, and I'll put that up in another time so you guys can go over it so we can try to keep this short. But all viruses, they look like that, right? They got those little sticky things on it. And from my understanding, what they do is they attach to cells, our cells, and they penetrate it almost like they hook to it like Velcro. And they start shooting a whole bunch of little baby uh, cells into it, which then either somehow it blows up like a balloon and explodes or they all just start entering the bloodstream and then what are they gonna do? They're gonna try to find another cell to attach to. Well, if you are taking this defense formula and it's an inhibitor and it's coding and protecting our cells and it cannot attach to it, then how can it reproduce? It can't, okay? It's very basic science and People are going to go, well, I mean, all of a sudden now somebody found it and it's natural. That's going to be the next thing that people talk about. Well, it's the same way all medication works. <laughs> enough scientists get together, enough research is done in a lab. And yeah, you formulate something that works. There's no difference in buying it uh, that's made in a lab with a whole bunch of chemicals. And the same as this, we, hello, it's evolution of science, okay? That's how all medication comes comes out is that we figure it out, right? The difference in this and that is this is natural, honey. This is natural. Um, you can take it with any other medication. There's no side effects. Um, and I think that's the beautiful part of it because in today's world, everything that you take has some sort of nasty side effect, does it not? So um, I just think this is, this is so huge. This is, sorry, I'm looking down at this because it's like the science is right here. And I hope that I have gotten through to at least one of you or at least one of you to go, you know what? Wow, I think they're onto something. And I can promise you, you're going to see so much more of this here in the next few weeks. And you're going to regret it if you're on the back order list of this. Um, I don't even know if they have any for sale right now. I got the first of this because I found it during their trial period. So I am so freaking lucky that I found it, but I can tell you this, I will be taking this stuff every morning 
and every night, probably for the rest of my life. It is worth it to me. The science is here. This is, um, let's see, I think it was like 20 something years in science on this, this one active ingredient and all that stuff's on the website. Um, let's see here. Let's see. I know it was on here somewhere. I don't want to keep y'all sitting here waiting, but I'm going to put all the facts and stuff at the end of the video and um, as well shoot, keep shooting it out to you guys because I don't want to, to bore you or get you guys um, distracted, but I want you to take a look at it for yourself. I just don't even remember the last time I was this excited about something. I feel like I have a voice and I have a platform and I need to use it and it's time for me to use it. It's been a little bit. Um, and right now I'm using it to let you guys know about Virapin. All right, stay safe, stay away from people, okay? And uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.